and Alyssa Abkowitz. She is on set to walk us through three pretty rockin' places for Valentine's yes. Day. Hi, yes. happy Valentine's happy Day. Happy Valentine's Day All right, to you as let's, well. Let's go Palm Beach. Let's go big. This, this is, is huge. Big. This is huge. Um, Citadel founder Ken Griffin has bought four different properties for a total of $130 million. This is huge. As you're seeing, three of them right here are oceanfront properties. That home that you're seeing in the middle is now a vacant lot. It was um, The home was torn down about a week before he purchased this property. That was the most expensive one. It went for nearly $42 million. Um, the other two went for uh, 35 and $37 million. And then wow. he also bought one property, as you're seeing right here, behind um, the southernmost property for $14.3 million. $14.3. Yeah. All right. So $130 million price yes. tag altogether. All right. That's not the only action happening in Florida. No, not at all. Um, over across the state in Sarasota, we have a wonderful home that just hit the market for $14.9 million. Um, it is the home of Money Show founders Kim and Charles Giffler. Uh, this place has five bedrooms, four baths, and three half baths. And a really big staircase. Very big staircase. Very big huge hallway. hallway. Huge hallway. Um, it's that. almost 11,000 square feet. Um, there is you a can roller skate in that hallway. You could. Right? Maybe That's we should you, try. We should try. What? Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, let's right, go. Right, anyway. Right. <laughs> Anyways, back to this. It's absolutely gorgeous. There is um, a wine room, a home theater, loges off most of the rooms. There's a bar with a fish tank in it, um, a bocce ball court outside, and you've got these gorgeous views, as you're seeing, of the Sarasota Bay and some of the barrier, barrier islands All around. Right. And if you can't, if Florida's not for you, Montana. Right. Now we can go to Montana. This is a great ranch that um, is owned by Grammy-winning music producer, musician, and songwriter James Guercho. Um, it is on the market for $25 million. Now this is about 45 miles north of Sheridan, Wyoming, to give you some perspective, because it is sort of in the middle of nowhere, right. Montana. Um, Everywhere in Montana is in the middle of good nowhere. Good point, good point. <laughs> um, here you will have a vast amount of property, more than 32,000 deeded acres. It also comes with eight solar-powered wells. Um, and uh, the interesting part about this, Wendy, is it used to be the headquarters of the Kendrick Cattle Company. And actually, U.S. Senator um, John B. Kendrick lived there from the late 1880s to 1913. So not only do you have this gorgeous, gorgeous, beautiful place. You've got the history behind you got this, the history. And a lot of property for this one. A ton of property right, for this 25 one. $25 That is private properties. Alyssa Abkowitz, thanks so much for being Thank with you. us. Appreciate it.